Yeah, and just to wrap that from the top down view of a CIO, we hear about the interests of the CEO, the CFO, you know, various areas of the organization. The key to all of what we do is people, processes, and technology. Obviously, technology enables the, what the people do through their process. Uh, and how do we strategically align it and sell it to them? How, how do we show that we add value as a company? Well, we do three things, basically. We run the business, we keep the applications up, we break fix, and we keep data centers up and operation. It's kind of an old role of technology folks. But recently, we're more of a transformer. I came into the business because our company was in a growth mode from 200 million to 600 million only a couple of short years. So in a, the strategic alignment of people in the process is what their pain points are, what their needs are, how to strategically plan, provide roadmaps for various areas of the organization is really the front end of how I sell to our company our value add of what we're doing for the business. Uh, very key in it is you know, mission planning. You know, what is the CFO? What, is, what does he feel is the most important thing that's happening in his area? What is his strategic alignment to our business and our growth of our business? Where strategically are we growing? Are we growing along one product line, multiple product lines? Do we focus on those product lines? Do we consistently stay aligned with the business and what it needs to do in the future? So strategy is very much key. So as we change the business and we transform the business, uh, you know, we align to the business and we add that value. Also, selling to the business and letting them understand that, hey, we're a cyclical industry, when we're in the down cycle, it's a good time to go out there and penetrate those shop floors that we couldn't get to while they're in the up mode. Uh, so we literally, in a downturn, we've actually acquired more projects to do during the uh, downturn than we had when we were in the upside. Uh, so we strategically align, we bring the technology to them. Obviously, the more technology we put on the, the shop floor for a manufacturing organization, the more visibility we get, more visibility we get. The more the various areas of the organization has its data that it can work on refinement, continuous improvement, uh, supply chain. If they can see it, they can help, help with it. If they can't see it, it gets very invisible. Um, one of our strategic initiatives is Boeing. You, know, you saw the 787 finally flew. Uh, strategically, we enabled that whole supply chain globally to get a visibility of that. Every material that we're making for Boeing put it on in cockpit that we can give Boeing real-time access to. So when they ask, are their parts going to be on time? They don't find out they're not on time when they're not delivered. They can find out that you know, they're actually in process, hitting the gates of the various suppliers when they're supposed to hit those gates. So visibility has been a big thing for us in creating it from the shop floor.